is CNBC's Morning Call with Ted David and Martha McCallum. Uh, about people winning cars and other expensive prizes, uh, hitting a hole in one. But who pays the freight on that when somebody actually wins? Believe it or not, you can buy hole-in-one insurance, and our next guest sells it, among other things. Mark Gilmartin is president of Hole-in-One International. He joins us from that great little gambling town called Reno, Nevada. Good morning and good to see you. Good morning, Ted. Nice to see you. All right, now, you do several interesting things, and we'll get to all of them in a minute. First, though, let's start off with this hole-in-one insurance. What is it? Who buys it? And how does it work? Well, basically, uh, for all those golfers out there, you've all come up to a par three and seen a car park there with a sign that says, knock it in and win. And uh, anybody can buy hole-in-one insurance from us. You basically give us a call with the length of the hole, the cash value of the prize, and the number of participants. We'll quote your price based upon the odds, and if someone in the tournament knocks it in, we'll, we'll pay for the car. And what is the premium on that cost? Boy, premiums depend on those three factors. The average premium is about $380, and it's very affordable for any corporate or charity event. Run by those factors again, if you would. The length of the hole, okay. obviously the, the yardage, the okay, hole, right? The easier, right? Uh, the cash value of the prize mm -hmm. costs a little bit less to insure a ten thousand dollar vehicle as opposed to a hundred thousand right. dollar vehicle, and then the uh, uh, number of participants in the event. The skill of the golfers has nothing to do with it. If, it, it actually does. The majority of the events that we do are amateur events. Okay. We charge about five times the amount for professionals. Okay. Uh, now, you also do, the, you have another business, Odds On Promotions. Tell us about that. You say that you basically insure anything. Under what conditions and what are the circumstances? Yeah, Odds On Promotions is a really fun business for us. It's the sister company of Hole in International. And it's basically designed for on all non-golf promotions, such as uh, half-court basketball shots at college and pro games, uh, direct mail contests. Everybody's gotten uh, direct mail pieces from their local auto dealers that say, come on down and check to see if you're a winner. We ensure contests such as that. Uh, we do dice roll promotions, pretty much anything you can dream up. How do you figure, you and I had chatted about this earlier, how do you figure, the, uh, there can't be actuary tables on all these things. And, and you had cited for me an example of trying to throw a football through the window of a truck. and I mean, obviously there's there's no table for that or what the risk is. Right. Well, we have hundreds of stock promotions, which we do have statistical data for. But when one comes along where we don't have any odds on paper, we gather up all the uh, washed up old jocks in the office and go outside <laughs> and, and throw the football around and put a few dents in some cars. So you will actually then test out and try. What's the wackiest thing that, that you've ever had to pay out on? Well, I had a feeling you were going to ask that. Uh, a couple of years we got a call from a, a farmer in the Midwest, and what he wanted to do is set a cow loose out onto a football field, and uh, whatever yard line the cow decided to drop his patty on, uh, <laughs> if that was the pre-selected yard line, then somebody would win a new tractor. So that's a uh, pretty oddball type and, of and, and dare I ask how you work the, uh, the, the odds on that? <laughs> well, it's, it's actually pretty simple. There's 100 yards in a football field, and uh, that's one out of 100 chance. And what? I'm sorry? A hundred yards on uh, a football field. Yards in the, and and each yard line is one yard, so that's Got one it. out of a hundred chance. Was there a, a possible? Okay, well I won't go any further than that. It's almost lunchtime. <laughs> Mark, thanks for joining us. Appreciate it. Interesting stuff. You've got a website too, right? Thanks for having me. Yeah, oddsonpromotions.com or holeinoneinternational.com. Okay, Mark Gilmartin, president of Hole in One International at Arena today. Thank you.